Hello, I'm Maria. Welcome to CookingDrunk.com. This video is designed to give you an idea on the best method for submitting your Cooking Drunk video. First, make sure to set your camera in the horizontal position. That means sideways, in case you're already drinking. Have your ingredients all prepped and set out ahead of time. Show the ingredients, show the process, and finally, show the finished dish. Your video should be about three minutes or less. If we select your video, you'll receive one of these fabulous Cooking Drunk aprons. Would you feel a bit more comfortable with a sample video? Me too. Here it is. And cheers. Hi, I'm Ellen, here to share my barbecue sauce recipe with you. It's great for either chicken or ribs, but today we're gonna make barbecued chicken. I bought a six pound bird and cut it up and seasoned it with salt, pepper, and garlic salt. I'm going to set it aside so that it warms a little to take the chill off. And while that's happening, I'm going to make the sauce. The sauce is made with a 28 ounce can of crushed tomatoes, Worcestershire sauce, red wine vinegar, brown sugar, dried mustard, chili powder, salt, and fresh lemon. Put all of them into the pot at one time and stir together. This is fun. And then we'll put it on the stove a low temperature or high temperature initially to bring it to a boil and then it will will reduce the temperature to a uh, simmer and cook it for 30 minutes. I've preheated my grill to 400 degrees. The chicken has been cooking for 20 minutes now and I've turned it twice. Now it's time to baste. I'll turn and baste the chicken every 10 minutes for a total cooking time of one hour. This is gonna be good. Well, the chicken's off the grill and smells wonderful. I usually serve it with corn on the cob and a tossed green salad and apple pie for dessert. So I hope you enjoy it and send us your video. Cheers.